Hey, Matt here, and welcome to Mob Street. Now today, I'm out here with my 2019... That's not my TW. That is a 2016 Honda Goldwing Trike. Look at that thing. Now, you might be wondering, what on earth is that TW guy doing with a Honda Goldwing? Well, it's kind of a crazy story, but this Goldwing right here is actually how I got my first TW200. Now, I want to tell you the story because it's kind of cool. It was a royal pain in my backside when I first got it, but this right here, I actually built this bike in my garage. So I drove to Vegas and I got the 2016 Goldwing and then I ordered the trike kit from Lehman Trikes out of California. And that thing right there weighs almost 1400 pounds. But it was a long drawn out process. I had the bike for almost a year. I was building it for actually some family that bought it and wanted me to turn it into a trike for them. And now here it is yet again in my possession. But this thing, oh my gosh, like I've done a lot with bikes before, but this was the most trying, most frustrating, most rewarding when it was finally done motorcycle that I have ever worked on. So take a look at this thing. As you can see, full on, I mean, if George Jetson were around today, this might age me, but if George Jetson were around today, this is what he would be driving. This thing has got every single bell and whistle that you could possibly imagine. You are darn near need a pilot's license for this thing. But look at this. Freaking heated grips, heated grips, heated seat. Watch this. Oh, guess what else it has? Check this. So, your navigation comes up. I feel like Tony Stark right here getting his stuff all fired up. But watch this. Maybe. Oh, oh, oh. There it goes. Check this out. Come on. Where are you at? Sucker has complete surround sound. I mean, you've got speakers there, 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 and there. Full on. I mean, everything that you could possibly imagine with this thing. 1,600 miles. Original miles. And this thing has been, well, it's been actually garaged for quite a while. Because the family that I built it for is now 84 years old and they're handing it off to another family member to ride So they wanted me to go through it check everything out on it make sure everything was good and I have to have it painted So if you are in the Utah area and you know of anybody who paints these things Maybe I'll hit up Robbie Layton and see if he wants to paint it. I Saw him paint a motorcycle for somebody not too long ago, but maybe we'll hit him up and see. But this thing, I mean, freaking storage everywhere. There's your trunk. Well, one of them anyways. And then I need two hands for this one. See if I can show this to you here. This one right here. <laughs> There's your other trunk. Look at all the space you have in that thing. I mean, good gravy. So yeah, it's got quite a bit of room. It's the Lehman Trike Monarch 2. I don't even know if that is even still available now or not, but man, you have got space galore on this bike. Now, honestly, like I said, this was one of the most frustrating bikes that I have ever worked on. And there were many nights that I came home just like, this is ridiculous. Come to find out, a lot of the pieces weren't going together right. And finally, after almost a year of struggling and trying to get this all going and talking back and forth to the trike company, it's like, look, these pieces are not going together the way that they're supposed to. What's the deal? 
And finally, after talking to their installation guy, he's like, dude, you have the wrong instructions. Here, you need these instructions. Emailed me the correct instructions, and within like two weeks, it was done. So, like I said, a little bit frustrating, but we got it put together. And if you're not familiar with the Goldwing, it's 1800 cc's. This is like the Honda Civic motor in a motorcycle. This thing accelerates like crazy, but here, let me turn it on for you so you can hear what it sounds like. Make sure our music's off this time, which I think it is, but check this out. You hear that? 1800 cc's hidden underneath that thing. And weighing in at almost 1,400 pounds, that sucker still pulls like a champ. Oh, and it has reverse. <laughs> it has reverse too. That's how I went from that road right there, backed up <laughs> to this road right here. But man, ah, uh, now I'm not gonna lie. I did not like this bike at all. I was really happy to see it go. It was extremely rewarding when everything worked. My family member came and picked it up. It was great. But now it's been kind of fun because my kids absolutely love riding on this thing. They're like, hey, can we go for a ride? So we'll run down, grab the mail, just run around town, whatever. So while I've got it, we'll create a few more memories and hopefully good memories. And like I said, if you know anybody that paints, put that in the comments down below. And the reason I said this is what got me my TW 200s. Once I finished this, my wife said, you need to go get something to just take your mind off of everything. And that is when my first 2019 TW came in. So because of this bike and my wonderful wife, I have a TW 200 and you guys have seen where it's gone from there. It's been awesome. It's been a blast. But I wanted to share this with you because there will be a few things on here. So I haven't totally abandoned the TW200, but there will be some stuff with the Goldwing. So if you know of anybody that paints or wraps vehicles, put that in the comments down below. And it will be painted or wrapped the Pittsburgh Steeler colors. That's what the family member who it's going to want. So questions, comments, put those down below. And as always, make sure to hit like, Hit subscribe and follow along because uh, we've got more with George Jetson's ride coming up. So I'm Matt. This is Mob Street. That's the Goldwing Trike. Thanks for watching.